Hi, my name is Dr. Serena Killam and I'm going to give you a quick walkthrough here on how to use Scrivener to write your thesis. Um, I wrote my thesis in Scrivener and I absolutely love it and I've regularly conducted workshops for postgrad students on how to use Scrivener. So this is going to be a pretty quick video just to give you um, a basic overview. I used to blog about this. I've thought about making a course on it for ages, but hopefully this is enough to get you started. So um, I'm going to assume that you've watched the introduction to Scrivener video. I'm not going to show you all the basics. I'm going to show you how you can set it up to make it work for you uh, for your thesis. So the first thing to do is um, to get a template and here I'm just going to go new project and we're just going to start with a blank one. I'm going to save it uh, right on my desktop and we're just going to call it thesis draft and I always like to give a date to my things because it really helps if you're coming back to find something later. So I'm going to maximize this now. So the first thing we should probably do is change this title up here to thesis. And then I want to add a bunch of folders which are going to be my chapter folders. So I just do a few under there and I'm just renaming them by clicking straight on the folder as you can see. All right. Um, we probably don't need these two. I've probably gone a bit over, so just move those ones to the trash. So then within our chapters, of course, we want some sections. So we can add some new sections here. Now, when I was getting set up, I did like to try and structure my chapters fairly similar, simil, in similar sizes or similar structure. So each chapter had an introduction and a conclusion. And then just depending on... Um, on uh, well, like what faculty or discipline you're from, um, it will kind of depend how you uh, rename these sections. Um, so I'm just calling them concepts here, but of course you can call them whatever you want. Main concept two. So um, if you find a structure that you like, you can also just duplicate that chapter. Now you can see here that it's just added numbers to it but again I could change this. Let's say I'm going to call this chapter four. I like that structure and then I can just drag it down um, and reorder it. Actually I want it inside the thesis and so there I've duplicated that exact structure from chapter one into chapter four um, but I've just renamed it. 